Hi there. Okay, so um, Mac Hatter here. Um, I'm going to do a video on punctuation and whether or not it actually makes a difference. Now, I haven't done anything on punctuation for a while, so the updated um, models, you know, it might not be relevant any longer, um, but we'll soon find out. Um, so, there's loads of different ways you can do punctuation in these things. Um, I'm just going to do the most common ones. So, comma, full stop and the um, the colon, uh, the double colon. So um, I'll do it in stable um, and we'll just put, let's just choose one of the, right, overgrown city covered in vines and moss. Right, and I shall go in here and I'll pick a few of these. Right, let's make a 8K resolution concept art. We'll use Mr. Gurney and we shall use Cell Shaded and Depth of Field and we could use, oh, I don't really, I don't want to use any of them. Oh, good old trending on art station. Why not? Everybody loves a trending on art station. Right, that's enough. So, no punctuation. Uh, and I'll do four images on each one. And I'll leave everything as is. And we're away. So, I'll just let that finish. And we'll have a wee look-see. So, no punctuation. Um, yeah, it looks pretty good to me. Pretty nice. I love that one. That's a belter. Right, so now we're going to duplicate that. And we shall add some commas in this instance. So, overgrown city, comma, covered in vines and moss. Right, and we'll pop a wee full stop in there. 8K resolution. Now, do you want it to be, this is where, this is where I used to think it made a difference. So, because this could be 8K resolution, concept art. So, 8K resolution, as well as concept art. Now, if I take the comma out of there, it's now 8K resolution concept art. So, it's one thing instead of as well as. Um, 8K resolution concept art. Now, here's here's where it definitely makes a difference. So, James Gurney or by James Gurney. So, I'm not changing the prompt, so I'll just leave uh, James Gurney. And again, James Gurney cell shaded. Doesn't make any sense to me. So, I want that to be a final part of the prompt. So, overgrown city, covered in vines and moss. 8K resolution concept art, James Gurney. And then this bit, cell shaded depth of field. Do you want it to be a cell shaded depth of field? Trending on art station? I'm just going to go cell shaded as well as depth of field, trending on art station, full stop. Right, let's see what happens. Okay, so with the commas, it's completely different. Um, how am I going to show you this? Duk, 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 duk. Let me just drag that out. Do that. Drag that over there. Right. So, is that the same one? It better be because they're exactly the same. Um, right, so that one. Ah, right, so yeah, so it's this. So this one was no commas. So you can see with the commas, look, there's buildings there. There's buildings there. So the commas have definitely separated it up and added, well, in this instance, I don't know if it's seed based or what, but in this instance, it's it's really brought out the, the city stuff. The commas seem to have done. There is a bit of city over here, look. See away there in the background and uh, maybe there. But it's definitely the commas, so as well as, or that's kind of the way I look at it, so overgrown city as well as covered in vines and moss. So, And this one is just an overgrown city covered in vines and moss. 
You know, you know what I mean? So it's showing you both here. It's showing you the overgrown city as well as the vines and moss. So the next one I would try uh, oh, is duplicate. But this time I'll pop in the old double colons. Now, if you were to do this in Mid Journey, Mid, Mid Journey definitely thinks that this is, when you do this, it's separate prompts. Because in Mid Journey, you can do something like this. Don't know if that works here. I don't really try that because if I want multiple prompts, I just add another prompt and do it that way. But now, when I used to do this in the past, and I still do it now more out of habit than anything else, I did this because to me, this was like a um, a hard stop. So overgrown city, one thing. Covered in vines and moss, add another thing. 8K resolution concept art, add another thing. You know what I mean? So let's see if that, how that holds up in this. So, do, 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 do. yeah, that's done. Everything's the same. Let's see what happens. Okay, so I've done, the, I've done the third one now, I think, somewhere. Right, let me have a wee look. So that's the third one. That's the second one. So the third one is the third one is the one with the, the double colons. Now what's happened here? Right, wait a minute, that can't be the right one. That's the second one there, look. So, right, see, it's hard to, it's, it's hard to figure out what's going on. Second one, it seems like the commas made it add almost like overgrown city and covered in vines and moss are two subject matters almost isn't it so you've got the city coming through compared to the first one where it was you know it's overgrown city covered in it's mainly the covered in vines and moss or should i say it's actually you know the city's in there just, but it's primarily been overgrown with vines and moss. So the thing you're seeing mostly is vines and moss. The second one, where the punctuation told it to do different things. So I want an overgrown city. I also want covered in vines and moss. So you've got the city, which is also covered in vines and moss. And then in this last one, hmm, it's difficult to say. There's, there's, there's some weird introductions of things like... You know, that's a um, a frame. We've maybe got some framing going on here as well. But it's also, it seems to have um, brought out some parts of the city here. There's an additional part there. There's nothing there. Um, there's bits, of, there's cables and stuff here. Now, those cables may be more city-like, whereas over here there were mines and Vossi. Eh? Vines and Mossy, <laughs> nice one. Um, and uh, this building over here has got more stuff growing on it. And um, so, to me, this is a this is a harder version of the comma. This is really separate out. It's saying, "I want an overgrown city." Stop. I definitely want that, and I definitely want covered in vines and moss. But I want both of them. I definitely want both of them. Um, I, yeah, it's. I don't really know how to explain it and how to put it into words properly that explains it perhaps sufficiently well for most people to understand. If you're anything like me, don't listen to anybody like me. Experiment yourself. You know, I can show you what it's done on that specific prompt and I can give you my interpretation of that. However, my interpretation might be completely different to yours. You know, that's what it looks like to me. So, um, I can't do any more than that. Make up your own minds. Uh, um, uh, experiment. But one thing I can tell you for sure, it makes a difference. 100%. Cheers. See you in the next video. Take it easy.